Hello everyone, this is Standpy with another Otomad reaction video. This time we'll be watching a brand new collaboration at the time of this recording, The Power of Terry, an Old Spice 10th anniversary collaboration. Now for those of you who are already slightly familiar with this, I actually contributed a little bit in the way of a commercial promo for this collab. Uh, I also, a little bit of a disclaimer, lent some vocals here and there uh, earlier this year. Uh, I don't quite remember everything I recorded as part of trying to keep it as fresh as I can for my viewing experience. So with that said, I have very limited knowledge of what is actually in this collaboration and I hope to keep it that way. With that said, we're going to take a look at this for the very first time, and we're going to have a lot of fun, I think. Uh, big fan of Old Spice collabs, Otomads, and of course Terry Crews himself, and the whole Old Spice marketing machine. It's really something unique, if there ever was one. So without further ado, let's dive right in. It's time for The Power of Terry, an Old Spice 10th anniversary collaboration. Let's take a look. Three, two... One, go. <laughs> Spice tails. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. Wow. <laughs> 
<laughs> yes. No. Yes. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Yo. Nice. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, we're going wrestling. Come on. Interview time. I'm going to Terry Crews. I don't want to be an actor and all that. What's the origin story of the yoga? I'm not a thing. I'm just going to wait for my baby. Who's been your favorite cameo on the show? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> no. Oh, this collab is so wild. We interrupt your regularly scheduled collaboration to bring you a word from our sponsor. This Christmas, join Cousins Craig and Payday for a brand new adventure in Friday After Next. I mean, Spice. Bear Glove. Stop. Merry Christmas, baby! <laughs> <laughs> I've been playing chess. Check me. <laughs> wow, this was really great. <laughs> <laughs> Friday after spice available now on DVD and VHS in video stores near you. Merry Christmas to everybody.
Wow. This is so good. <laughs> Going to Brazil, man, get out of here. Galaxy Man stage. Oh my god. Oh wow. Oh man. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Terry would never. Next door, I see you, Van. <laughs> that locker. It's me!
<laughs> Yo, what a collab. So, first and foremost, that was great. I loved what I just witnessed. Uh, I will admit that I am, when it comes to audio and visual, I am much more interested in what I'm seeing a lot of the time. And I judge visuals more harshly. And I was just absolutely wowed by a lot of things I saw in this collab. It had so much soul. It was so well made. High fidelity without being just flash, without substance. There was a lot going on and it actually meant something. Good visual references. Good execution. And oh my, great job guys. First and foremost. Wow, that was, <laughs> that was a terrific collab. Uh, so, all right, let's get into the nitty gritty a bit. There were a lot of parts I liked, and it, when I see something like that, you know, 16 minutes of power, right? That's beautiful. I like the timing on that. Uh, it's it's awesome. You know, it's just there was so much going on. Um, one of the things I love about Old Spice as a source is that it's clean, and I don't mean that as a pun. I mean it's it's you know it's it's a very clean, safe, safe for work. You know, it's safe for TV, so you could show it and and experiment with it in a lot of ways, but. I think uh, Terry Crews himself, you know, he is one of my favorite actors and favorite celebrities in general. I don't typically give, you know, much attention or care toward, the, you know, what's going on with different celebrities. But I have always respected Terry Crews a lot because he's a, a good man. You know, you could just tell, like, he, he walks with goodness in his heart and he cares about people, you know. And he uh, he's not a typical Hollywood jerk. So with that in mind, I mean, you know, it's wonderful to me to have collaborations honoring such a person. Uh, and from my understanding, I've seen tweets. I mean, Terry's seen this and he's loved it. And I'm so glad that he got to see it. And I'm so glad for everybody who worked on this. And, and it, you know, inadvertently, I, I contributed to this collab in very small ways, just with vocals and, and a video for the promo. But, you know, it was still, like, I, it's exciting when I think of it, like, wait, I was a part of this too, you know? Uh, for those who didn't pick up on it, when we got to our Friday After Spice uh, that was my narration for the commercial voiceover there. Uh, but beyond that, I mean, there was just so much cool stuff. What I loved about this, this really felt like, uh, as far as the sources that were you, or rather the, the specific songs and pieces that were being referenced, I mean, obviously the Old Spice side of things is one thing, but the actual content, you know, going from game to game to anime to whatever, all the different pieces that were used, I didn't even want to interrupt because it was so much at, at happening at once. And I feel like normally I complain about things being overproduced, but I didn't feel that way a lot of the time with this. I felt like there was a lot of substance behind the technical execution that really made this an awesome collab to look at. Um... I, you know, just on the gotcha side of things, I spotted Van in that one bit. I said, I shouted it out. I may be wrong, and I don't like to be wrong and say something wrong, but I, I'm going to take a chance here. During the bit in, in Gangplank Galleon, when uh, there was a silhouette of Bayonetta, I'm going to just say that I think that was Biolante, but uh, <laughs> I may be wrong, but I think it was. And that was very funny to me. At least I thought it was, so that made me laugh. Uh, but beyond that, I mean, there was just so much fun in this collab. I'm going to watch it again and like watch it because this, this collab is the definition of, of eye candy without being like insanity. You know, it's, it's easy to follow and it's 16 minutes of just awesome Terry Crews, Old Spice, and even our boy Isaiah Mustafa, right? It's just all the whole thing is, the whole thing is awesome. It's so good. Like it, it's it was a lot of visual fun to look at and I, it's satisfying as a as a fan of of Otamad and YTPMV to get a collab that comparing this to the last Old Spice collab which was good uh but this was like great you know i i think my biggest my biggest criticism um and i noticed it particularly during the moon sequence um but in other places too 
the audio definitely I, I heard criticisms from you know here and there and murmurings on the airwaves but I hadn't seen the collab but um, I definitely uh, listening to it it did feel that it could have it could have used some additional tweaking to to sound better um, to go along with incredible visuals because I really I was very impressed with the visual side of this collab I think the the visuals were the, just a game terrific terrific collaboration terrific job done. Uh, it was beautiful to watch, and, and I'm so glad to have been a part of it, just just even in the small way that I was. Um, and even then, the audio, though it wasn't perfect, I mean, it was good in a lot of places. I just feel like there was so much happening with this collab. And again, it's like almost all of it's Terry. So it's like you have an even smaller window of things that you can experiment with, yet the creativity that was showcased in all these different parts of having Terry doing different things and, and in relation to the games and, and shows and content that he was in, I mean, this really felt like a much more Western collab than a Japanese one, and that should you know that should speak for itself on the content that was chosen. But I really felt like I was looking at almost like a throwback of a lot of what I'm interested in, and, and you know stuff that was just related to the stuff I grew up looking at online, and you know even just something like Silver Surfer. I was thinking like makes me think of the ABGN, like you know the music in that game's great, but that's one of the reasons the game's popular is because it's bad. But, I mean, there was just so much happening in this collab. I mean, I could just, like, mouse, you know, quickly go through it. I mean, the, the Toho stuff was fun. Uh, I love Rhythm Heaven anything. So when I saw that, I was absolutely ecstatic. Uh, but I'm just, like, mousing, you know, going right through now uh, on this timeline here of all the different stuff. And it's just there was a lot of, of really fun things going on that... So, like, all right, one of the things I've noticed that happens in, like, every collab nowadays is that we do get a lot of the same material. Like, we'll pick the same songs, and, and every collab has those same songs, you know, because they're just iconic parts of the culture at this point. Um, brain Power. I don't ever really want to see a collab end on Brain Power ever again because IWF did that, and, like, that for me is where that is like in my head that's how they you know i i just i see that and um so i'm always scared a collab's about to end when i start hearing brain power because it brings me back to you know to iwf but um you know i think one of the things that we want to always strive for in these collabs is to be distinct right to not feel like other collaborations and i uh, galaxy man i said it during but like i love galaxy man i love Mega Man 9 so like that was a huge surprise it was super fun um, there was a lot of stuff in here that was awesome. The Shantae bit was great. The very Gangplank Galleon. There was just so much happening. The visuals, again, for just about every part. The, the Mother 3 stuff. I mean, it was it was really quite an awesome presentation overall. And I'm so glad to have uh, been witness to it. Uh, everything start to finish. Even the, 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 a strong opening with Mario Brothers 3. Like, this whole collab was just start to finish. I did not feel bored or uninterested at any point in time. Um, I've seen there is a, uh, <laughs> a, a, a face, you know, algorithm that exists for my reaction enjoyment of a collab. And I think, uh, if you run that algorithm, you're going to find that I enjoyed this collab almost entirely the way through. Uh, I very rarely was at a neutral expression. I hurt my face smiling from the beginning because I, I, it's just, it's so good. And, um, I don't, you know, I don't want to overhype. I think this was a really... An awesome visual collab. Audio was fine, but not amazing. Uh, and I don't mean to parrot other people's opinions, but I did notice it particularly in the moon for DuckTales. Um, but the visuals went with it. That's one of those things where, like, if there's a disconnect between audio and visual, it sticks out, you know? Um, and it's particularly noticeable when you have another collab not terribly long ago. In the case of... Uh, we had a McDonald's collab that featured DuckTales Moon. So that also comes to mind as well. You know, that's always the risk when you pick a song that others have done. But one of the best compliments I, I can have about here, you know, I made the comment about Kitchen Gun in the Kitchen Gun collab, how there was too much of the same, right, of using the same sources. I felt like there was a lot of old in terms of what I'm familiar with and also a lot of new. It was like, dang, I never expected to see this in a collab. Like, again, Galaxy Man was like a huge, whoa, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> so I am, uh, I'm, I'm overall thrilled at the quality of this production. Just, you know, I think it's a great step in the direction for, for quality Otomad content in, from now and into the future. Great job, guys. Uh, I think if anything would, would be odor blocking power, it would be, you know, this collab because it definitely doesn't stink. It's terrific. 
And uh, I, <laughs> terrific. Yeah, I, I plan on watching it again very soon. And that's a testament to an enjoyable collaboration. It was just nonstop fun. Uh, and I guess as a note for brain power, if you really want to have a high end over the top brain power section, it's got to basically be seizure inducing. Like it's got to flash and flicker even more than it did in this. Uh, if it doesn't make my eyes like, you know, like that when I'm done, like almost watering and like, please no more, then it wasn't a proper brain power segment, but it was still a good one. But again, you know, always going to go back to comparisons. I felt like these transitions were also like, there were so many crazy transitions that I had no idea what to expect. This is definitely an all over the place, nonstop, wild, fun motion graphics festival of awesome of all disciplines, and I think everybody who worked on this project should be proud of being a part of something so incredible. I'm I'm honored to be on this team, to have my name in the credits. So thank you so much for having me, guys. I really appreciate it. And I, of course, appreciate you guys making this this awesome collaboration. And, and once again, thanks so much for having me a part of it. Terry, I know you're a busy guy, so if you happen to see this uh, almost 30-minute reaction and review to this collab, I just want to say once again, you the man, and uh, you're a great role model for kids out there, and obviously a great inspiration because look what got made so keep up the good work on that front everybody who's working on these collabs keep improving your skills even if i had some criticism it's not criticism for you to give up it's criticism for you to keep improving keep working toward your skills because they are incredible skills that you all have and you should be so proud of what you've achieved great job on this collab i'm so excited for what could possibly come next this is now officially old spice is cemented as this is one of my favorite sources now great job until next time this is stampi thanks for watching and as always p -p 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 power <laughs> i don't know i love you guys until next time <laughs>